Hello, welcome to my channel and this is Kalmatek TV. This time, I am going to teach you how to replace photoconductor drum model Rico Apicio 201. Let's start! First, open the front door, push up the green lever, and the second one to the right. Disconnect photoconductor connector. Open side door. Push the PCU lock with thumb and pull out PCU. Proper handling is in horizontal position only. Remove the screws of the rear guide. Remove rotating cam gear and the rear guide. Remove two screws of the front cover and the front cover. Remove screw and the drum guide. Also remove the last screw to separate the upper from the lower. Hold the drum in the upper casing at the same time and slowly push it away from you. Slide the drum out and remove it. Slide up the charge roller with pushing and the spring and remove the brush remove the holder of the brush and remove the cleaning blade Let's begin installing the brand new OPC drum and cleaning blade. Put regular powder on cleaning blade before installing. Make sure the guides are inserted through the hole. Two rounded screws for the cleaning blade. Put back brush holder. Just lay both ends of brush. Return the charge roller. The white side bushing is at the front and the black is at the rear. Slide down gently and make sure both bushings are in the right place of the guide and make sure that both springs are aligned press charge roller for tension check install drum rear side first and the front side down to the guide Make sure to press the drum while aligning it on top of the lower unit. Align the screw hole as pointed. Align the rear guide and align it to the rear end slot. Maintain pressing the drum until the upper is on top of the lower. Return front guide of the OPC drum 
and secure the screw next is the rear guide align the shafts through the hole and secure the screws do not forget to return the rotating cam gear because if you do you will be having white copy outputs Put back the front cover and secure the screws. Secure the last screw. There are seven screws and two separate screws for the cleaning blade. Check the drum for a smooth turn and you're done. If not, open the unit and recheck again. Return the photoconductor unit back to the machine. Make sure the hole hits the guide. Connect the photoconductor socket. Return the toner hopper assembly. Push it until you hear the lock sound and press down the green lever. Close the front door and the side door. And let's check the copy quality of the machine. To achieve good toner image sensing, clean ID sensor. We will check developer initialize on SP mode. Press clear. 1, 0, 7. Press and hold clear stop for 3 seconds. And press 1. Select drum. And press OK. Scroll to select developer initialize. Press OK. And execute. Just wait until it's completed. Directly turn off main switch and turn on. And we will check toner bottle rotation if it's normal. Just remove receiving cover. Make a copy and double check toner bottle rotation return receiving cover close the front door and we're all done that's it guys I hope you've learned from this tutorial and if you do please like and subscribe Thank you for watching Kalmatech TV. Bye!